alive? I seem to think it should be live by now. I don't... You'll say that I'm alive. I... Sorry, guys. I upload many. Welcome to my YouTube You'll channel. You'll say that I'm alive. I... Oh. <laughs> Sorry, guys. That. Still trying to get the handle of, of the streaming on YouTube. Uh, I still don't have everything going. Uh, I'm working on it. I tried to get the... Like, I don't know if XSplit and the stream stuff isn't working together like I don't understand it shows that I'm live though so we're just gonna roll with it for now prospect so uh I spent most of yesterday a lot of today uh just trying to build stuff better for the YouTube channel trying to get things working better uh, and just generally trying my best to work better at do. Uh, it's it's a learning process. Please stick with me. I really appreciate everything you guys are doing. Uh, I appreciate the people that are coming out and do. Uh, the uh, moving from from Twitch over to YouTube and kind of kind of build the, the brand in general bigger. Uh, it's a learning process. Uh, YouTube is a different animal, uh, and, and we're slowly getting there. Still don't Once again, our music is brought to us by Crossroad Rocks. They're always awesome. Uh, there should be a leak down in the bottom of the screen there. Uh, Crossroad Rocks. I failed miserably. You may have failed miserably. Uh, so we're going to get to uh, Icarus. Uh, we're just gonna do some uh, some gathering. Uh, Pete was uh, busting his butt helping me get some stuff set up today, uh, and uh, I told him that we were going to uh, play Icarus. Uh, however, he uh, he had work and stuff to do, so I'm gonna do it anyway. So hopefully, hopefully he'll be able to come in and. This. Uh, if you can't, uh, I'm just going to gather some resources. Just generally. Uh, we, uh, we need lots of resources. And I need some storm exposure. So I haven't had enough of that today. Clear out some of these trees from around the house. So yeah, uh, so I tried to use the studio. I tried to use the thing uh, the way I was told to go live. Uh, but it doesn't seem to grab uh, X Split uh, and uh, YouTube don't seem to want to play well together. Uh, so I'm not sure exactly what's going on there. It's just a learning process and trying to figure out how to do it. Uh, I will eventually figure it out. Uh, I just, I worry that uh, but it may not be working. 
I'm, unfortunately, I'm not going to get that to fill. Uh, give me some time in here. I need somebody else to come and talk. Actually, I'm going to go. Yeah, so it's just going to be a, just a, a nice slow day of uh, gathering resources, just stockpiling some stuff. Oh. Oh, okay, so that is working. I am getting that across. For some reason, the studio still doesn't show that I'm live. Um, so obviously, like I can go to my page I'm live, but my studio doesn't show that. So I'm obviously doing something wrong. That's a fun place for that. Nope, oh, no doggy. Bad doggy. So um, I'm just going to use tonight to kind of uh, get some, uh, just gather some resources, uh, just to really put some stuff together uh, so that once we start the morning, up, running, if you're wondering, uh, so Tuesday through uh, Saturday mornings, I stream over on Twitch. Find me at Twitch TV slash uh, Uh Yeah, you can come over and hang out with us there. Uh, most most of our stuff that we do is is over there. Um, I'm trying to get a. Uh, I put hold over here on YouTube, uh, so I'm trying to to uh, let people know that we're we're alive and that we're okay, and uh, trying to, to figure out the ins and outs of a different platform. I figure worst case scenario, it may actually uh, may actually just become a better streamer, so it's not a not a bad deal. Uh, so learn some different tricks, learn some different ways to do stuff. Uh, uh, if nothing else, uh, we get the community, we get more places for, for us to find people and bring them in. We just generally have uh, more awesome people in the community. Cool. As far as I'm concerned, it's a win win. I'll put, oh, I can't pick it up. I don't have that. Perfect. Need that back. Turn 
know how many rocks I need. I get like maybe 200. Or You're probably gonna try to. I would go find a, a king to let you survive. To be honest, uh, Pete knows a lot more the ins and outs of this game. Uh, I'm playing it, having a good time, having fun. Uh, but it's definitely the. Uh, Weird. All right, just generally trying to figure some stuff out. Oh, oh that helps if I hold the right place. Ah, still. So we're just gonna do some some uh, mining here. Uh, these are uh, the tools that I'm using are. Once you get for playing the game a long time, uh, Pete had some extra points, so he got me an extra set of tools. I'm uh, slowly trying to get enough points to be able to do that stuff. Uh, and also being able to start getting exotics, uh, start, start working our way through the, uh, the roguelike type functionality of this game. I gotta shoot you in the face. About that many times for you. If nothing else, it helps me get some experience because uh, I am lacking in the experience department in this game. I, uh, when the game first came out, I played for a little bit, uh, but not really enough. Uh, not really enough to get that far into it. Uh, I played for a little bit. Uh, there was other games that I had. Really. Nope. Like your melon. I would appreciate it if you guys stopped trying to get me. I don't like it, sir. Pickets. Or an axe. This bones. Oh, I need a bone. Uh, the knife's doing okay. Shred it. Eat some meat. We need to see if I can make a grind. I have lots of points uh, I haven't spent on stuff uh, because I didn't know what to spend them on. To be honest, I uh, I didn't I didn't know uh, didn't know the uh, best option there. I think I'm gonna try to make a shot right. Right. Let's yeah, let's reach the yeah. Well make a try right in my backpack. I do not 
What's this? Start a drain break. Next up, which that's the crafting bit. Make a drain rack on that. Oh, there it's drain. Uh, I need some wood and some fibers. But yeah, so, oh yeah, here it goes. Finally decided that I was alive. The, uh, my other page is bigger than that. Yeah. Don't worry about it. Yeah, it's still just sitting there. It's like, connecting stream software to go live. Viewers will be able to, yeah. No, dude, I'm already live. I don't understand why Yeah, I don't know. I have, I have broken this thing somehow. That's in empty. Oh, I can make one now. So I'm going to uh, work on streaming more often over here. Uh, I really wanted to stream last night. I uh, streamed tonight. plan on streaming tomorrow night also. Uh, basically what I'm going to do is the days that I'm off that I don't work, uh, I'm going to try to stream at night over on YouTube. Uh, and hopefully uh, kind of have that be a, a, a good way to kind of to split the uh, the difference. Uh, I still want to keep uh, the community and everything we have over on on Twitch. I don't want to lose that. Uh, we have an awesome community over there, and anybody here uh, is more than welcome to come join us over there. And obviously, anybody that's there, more than welcome to come join us here. Uh, Trying to have a very inclusive. Uh, very inclusive uh, community. We want people to feel like they're welcome and that they can come and hang out and have a good time. Uh, just be about playing the games, just just having a good time. Uh, really, the, the, the way we try to do it. Uh, there's a link for the Discord down at the bottom. Uh, feel free to come join us over there. You can get uh, information about when I go live. Uh, I'm trying to trying to make myself more accessible uh, and more open uh, for people that do want to come and hang out or want to come and uh, talk. Every once in a while, I'm gonna try to do like a Discord stream or uh, something like that, so that if uh, if people are around. They want to be able to talk into the score if they can uh that way uh if people want to ask questions or you know talk and chat we can we can kind of do that uh try to keep a you know everybody love everybody type attitude there as long as everybody's treating each other with respect and kindness 
uh, we're all good. We're, we're, we're a happy, happy little group of people. Probably don't need that. Three is probably going to be more than enough. Um, <laughs> other, other things that we do over there. Uh, I am, you know, if you're a streamer, if you're uh, somebody's trying to make YouTube content, stuff like that, uh, I have sections on Discord for you specifically, not, you know, you specifically, but people that, that have questions that are trained to learn how to do this stuff. Uh, matter of fact, my, uh, all the stuff that I'm finding out from building uh, YouTube or the lessons that I'm learning, I'm trying to make sure that I have, uh, I'm capturing that so if somebody else comes by later, they, they have similar questions. Uh, this stuff is there. Uh, I, I'm not trying to, I, I don't do well when I got a secret. Uh, if I have, If I have information and it will help somebody, I'm all about trying to help them. Uh, I'm not trying to uh, go out on a limb and be like, oh no, I, I, you can't know that stuff because, uh, screw that. Uh, I, I would much rather, rather share and for, for us all to grow as a um, I don't really foresee um, I, I take a very weird approach. Uh, I don't foresee other streamers as a, as a, uh, as competition because I'm me. Like I, I, I do what I do. I, I, you know, do work what I do, and especially that's where I'm. If you're on Twitch or if you're on YouTube or wherever, if somebody somebody doesn't want to, to watch you, they're not going to watch you. Uh, and there's nothing... Like I, I can try to convince them to stay and hang out. But for the most part, I can't. Like, people are going to do what, what they want to do. Uh, it's your time. It's your stuff, right? So I'm really bad about especially the whole you know oh make sure you okay there's there's some buttons down there you can do stuff you can not do stuff you're your own person do what you gotta do. i'm like you're on youtube you know what it is uh i'm trying to get at least uh to remind people uh that the buttons are there i don't know i'm on I'm, I'm just jibber jabbering just, i'm just running my mouth tonight uh, I'm gonna sit here and talk to myself for a couple hours. And we'll see. Uh, we'll see how that works out for me. Oh, you stopped running. I'm just gonna shoot arrows at all of you too. Somebody, somebody catches me. I'm the one that catches. Um, I never said I was good at games. I just, I just enjoy playing them. I do do a lot of survivally building games. Uh, we do. Uh, this is kind of. I won't say out of our warehouse. It is a survival game. It is a builder game. Uh, we do more factory building games. We do more automation uh, when we can. Uh, Factorio, Satisfactory, Fortress Craft Evolved. Uh, those things. Uh, we have an event coming up in November, November 5th and 6th over on Twitch. We'll be streaming for 12 hours a day uh, where we uh, basically are playing a game called Fortress Craft of All. Uh, Fortress Craft of All is, I think, uh, satisfactory with Minecraft graphics. Um, it's, a, it's an older game. It's six, seven years old. Uh, the game is awesome. If you like factory building games and you've never played uh, Fortress Craft, 
do yourself a favor go check it out uh it is it is a awesome awesome game uh really in depth a lot of stuff to do in it uh i think you know the game's like 30 dollars or something and i've got like two thousand flipping hours in uh i i've definitely got my money out Yeah. Yeah. Um, so, and, uh, basically what happens is we, uh, there's a mechanic in the game and, uh, the more of the items that we put into the game, the more upset, really? Really? Just dinner coming to me. Work. Oh, Jesus. No, stop it. Kill the wolf that's murdering you. Well, that was fun. So, uh, I'm trying trying out some new stuff, like I said. We're going to come over here. We're going to stream a little bit. Uh, we're going to try to put, make some videos. Uh, the streams that we have from... Uh, from Twitch and the streams that we have here. Uh, I've got an editor uh, lined up that uh, they're trying to learn. They're really interested in learning how to edit. Uh, Jesus. Really? What the heck is it with you guys today? What did I do? Spawn in the middle of freaking the wolf den? Oh, that is not what I wanted to do. Um, so, uh, once, once we kind of get a little bit more into that, uh, I'll try to see if I can get him in, uh, have him say hi, uh, and I, I, I want to make sure that, you know, as a, as a general rule, uh, they're, they're given, given their due for, for editing the videos, uh, we'll, we'll see how they all work out, um, uh, it is what it is, like, uh, but we're just trying something different, trying, you know, I think it's going to be a little bit more comical. Uh, I, I want to go a little bit more comical, uh, just because, why not? Um... Okay, that was, uh, I don't know why I did that, but, okay. <laughs> this guy. If nothing else, I have lots of, uh, Lots of food. So 
Right in the nose. I'm getting better with this bow stuff. So yeah, it's not going to be a super, uh, super awesome stream, uh, but it'll be a stream. So it's, uh, it's all working on getting me out there, getting me used to streaming on YouTube. I don't know about the that compression bell. I don't know if it's just my, uh, I wonder if my, my player is dropping some. Especially when I pump or jump around, like it art is artifacted really bad on my screen. But I don't know if that's just because, uh, Because I'm not uh, actually watching. It's just it's just like, oh, okay, drop the screen down. It just went to auto. Minor showers, no. Probably don't get experience with things. That'd, that'd be a bit of power. That'd definitely be cheesy. this axe soon. So the problem is with these, I do not believe I can repair them. to go find
while we're in here. Maybe I should. Talents. Do I have any talent? Oh, I have a talent point. I do like the resources branch. Captwood is automatically added to your inventory. I like that. That sounds good. Damn it. Run to the trees. Oh, it unlocks the ability to turn wood and sticks. Okay, well, I guess, uh, I guess I'll start doing that. The picking up wood stuff is, is a good idea. Increase the of stones. Increase yield from metal to metal deposits. That'd probably be better. See stone in addition to resources with mining order. I don't know if I want to get stone out of. Uh, hey, Pete. No worries, but yeah, I still don't know what the hell I'm doing. Like my the studio doesn't show that I'm live. I I don't know. I broke it somehow. I, I've not set up something correctly somewhere. Okay, so I can do all the iron stuff. So, ankle bench is probably a good thing. Which that stuff is probably a good thing. Taxi? Crossbow, I kind of want. I still got like 14 points, even after I got all that stuff. Um, one book probably would be bad. Stuff. Uh, get some other armor. Probably isn't a bad plan, to be honest. It's a big Alright, so we're going. Leather and fiber. Uh, I need lots of leather and lots of fiber. Only I knew a guy that was planning. The melody was enough to rewrite my story. There's no 
You probably have enough weather. You pull me out from the dirt and you redefine me. You'll pick up some small bushes, rubberies. I need the card rubbery. Yay! Give me rabbit! Oh, I got a rabbit killer? Uh... That's... I don't, I don't know if I want that rabbit. Can I give it... Can I give that one back? I'm not gonna wear it! Oh, let's see. Crafting, crafting, crafting. A stick. Carrots. I love pencil rock so much. Like some of the music is in here is so good. The fact that it's here and free that the artist just allows us to use on our streams and stuff. It's just, they're amazing. Really, that many, uh, right, get that, crap that. Oh, there's two. Back. You know what? I don't know if Keith needs armor. I'm gonna make Keith armor too. Because if nothing else, it gives me experiences. Oh, something else. Alright, I'm low on fibers. Go figure. Look at me. I'm all prepared for battles. Need more bushes. Now, Icarus is a cool game. I, I'm really appreciating it. Uh, I'm starting to get further into it. I'm still not. They're changing it and back up a little bit from the. Oh, I freaking scared the crap out of it for a minute. Holy crap! Freaking stop. A damn heart. I just saw freaking red eyeballs in the distance, and I was like, oh crap, I'm dead. I was gonna shoot at it, but I was like, that's not gonna end well for me. Bridges. I have made the bridges. Okay, when you do make it in, uh, you will have the armors. 
best armors I can make. Once this all gets done. They said, we're, we're, we're going to try some different stuff. Uh, like, I'm trying to figure out YouTube. two. Uh, it, it's, it's a different animal to approach. And if, you, if I approach YouTube and try to make it fit in my little Twitch box, uh, it's not going to work for me. I, I want to talk a lot about this next, next, you know, probably a while, uh, just because it, it is what is on my mind. It's, you know, the big thing that we have, especially somebody coming from, from YouTube or, or coming over from Twitch to YouTube. Uh, it, it's, it's a different world. Uh, if you're on Twitch and you think that you shouldn't come over here, think that, you know, Whatever reason you have, if you got some sort of brand loyalty to Twitch because you think that you owe them something or you don't. Like seriously you don't. Uh it's a it's a corporation, just like any other corporation. Uh they they love you uh as long as you're producing the money. Uh and the big difference and the, the difference that I have seen, I've really only uh, been seriously hitting YouTube for about the last month uh, and really the last couple of weeks. Uh, I, I saw some stuff in some of my YouTube videos, uh, which, which are not the best, to be honest. Like I, I'm still trying to figure this stuff out. I'm not making awesome videos. Uh, I'm working on. It. I'm, I'm trying to learn, I'm trying to paint. Uh, but I have a couple of videos. I got extremely lucky, and I had a uh, I had a video that for me is done extremely well. Uh, I think it's sitting at like. 600 views or something, 630 views or something. Uh, and in, in the grand scheme of things, for YouTube, that's pennies. That's, that's, I, I don't even get paid for it because I, I don't get paid for stuff on YouTube. Uh, but most YouTubers, if they had a, a video that did 600 views, they're like, yeah, whatever. Like, what, what, what did I do wrong? Um, for me, just starting out, 600 views is amazing. Uh, it is uh, literally like, holy crap! Okay, maybe maybe I was wrong about this whole idea. Maybe I need to get my head out of my butt, and maybe I need to actually put some effort into. Um, so. Uh, by doing that and by actually putting some effort in, I, I'm seeing returns. I need headphones today. Headphones. Uh, by putting some effort in, I'm actually starting to see, okay, yeah, th this is, this is a good plan. Like I, this, this is a good plan. Um. Uh, so I would tell anybody that is trying to figure out whether or not they want to come over to YouTube. Shia LaBeouf said it best, just do it. Like seriously, just start doing it. Start learning it, start figuring it out. Uh, there's a there's a learning curve to it. Uh, do, not, do not come into YouTube like you're a really bad Twitch person. Uh, and think that you're going to get away with uh, the same stuff that you know is acceptable on Twitch, uh, and think that just because you have 
you know, 800 followers on Twitch means that, that you're starting over. It's a new platform. Treat it as such. Uh, try to try to learn what you need to do to grow. Uh, hell, I don't even have the ability to uh, have a uh, <laughs> a custom URL. <laughs> it's just it's, I I need a hundred subscribers just to get a custom URL, and I can't do it. Um, so I, I I'm working on it. You know, it's just it, it takes it's going to take time. And that's not that's not a bad thing. Uh, it means that you have to work for it, and working for it is not necessarily bad. It's just you need to work for it, and you need to to do that. Now, a lot of things are too is the discoverability and stuff on on YouTube. I've heard a lot of people scream about, "Oh, the discoverability is bad." The discoverability, it, it's it, YouTube is showing people what they want to see. Um, so if people come over to YouTube and you never search for a live stream, guess what? You're never going to see a live stream. Um, if you don't go out of your way to go find some live streams and tell the algorithm, oh, Pete, Pete's logging in. Um, if you never go into YouTube and you never search for a live stream, YouTube's not going to show you a live stream because you haven't searched for one. Okay? You ever wonder why when you go into YouTube, it's not showing you like rock tumbling videos or it's not showing you uh, how to plant a garden videos? Well, it, it may be showing you that stuff. I don't know your, your algorithm. But the algorithm on YouTube is specific to each person. Your algorithm is completely different than mine because the stuff you click on is the things that it's going to show you. Uh, so it, it's, if you never search for for live chat or live channels, it will never show you a live channel. There's a suit of armor for you in the uh, the box or in the captain. I didn't make a backpack though. Hold oh, on, backpack. <laughs> yeah, hello. How uh, are you doing today? Oh, I'm I'm awake, so that's that's a bonus. Uh, yeah, I can wouldn't... make backpacks. Would you like a backpack? I can make backpacks now too. Well, I'm setting the rope crafting that you need. Um so obviously I'm gonna talk a lot about that, uh, you know, trying to talk a lot about the the change, the move, right? That that change, that move, it's it's scary, uh, and it's scary for me to go. Oh, you know, I'm over here. I have, uh, you know, so many subscribers, I get paid so much money, people can come in and give me bits and all that. And I come over to YouTube and none of that stuff can happen. Um, like I, it's, I, I, you're, you can't join the community over here. I don't even have a community over here because YouTube doesn't recognize it. Uh, like I, I haven't proven myself to YouTube. And I can't just come in and be like, but don't you know who I am? I guess I could go out caring on them. I'm sure that would move my chances. Um, <laughs> um, but I, I'm, you know, you got to start someplace. Uh, but in the grand scheme of things, in the long run, yeah, Twitch has got a, a revenue stream. YouTube has a, a good path to revenue stream. The other side of it too is, is I'm pretty sure the revenue stream on like the path to partner on YouTube seems a lot easier than the path to partner on Twitch. Um, I, I and, and and I don't I don't mean to to make it I don't mean to say that the path to partner on YouTube is easy. The path to partner on YouTube is still a difficult road. It is still difficult to do. Uh, it takes some work and it takes some some. 
forethought and it takes some some uh, some actual work and time um but i believe the difference is is on youtube if i keep putting that work in and i keep putting the work in and i keep putting the work in eventually i will move the boulder and i will have partner on youtube twitch i've been putting work in on twitch for seven years and i've been pushing pushing and i've been pushing and the boulder's not moving um so <sighs> i believe that the uh the path to partner on youtube is, is a lot more obtainable <laughs> oh and by the way uh there seems to be a lot of wolves in this area yes yes there is they, what uh, level are you uh, at now uh, 18. Yep. You're now in Wolf Town. Uh, Don't worry. I, Once you get I, to level 25 to 30, the game starts regularly throwing more bears. Oh, good. That's what I, that's what I needed, bears. Um, <laughs> I, I had a, a thing where I, uh, I come up over, a, uh, I was sitting down here and shot a, a rabbit or something. And get attacked by about six wolves in a row. Like I would murder one, turn around, and then murder another one. Um, I was just randomly kind of leveling. I don't know, or and gathering. I didn't know what to actually do. Oh, uh, yeah. That I know there's a a list on the left side there. Well. Those are our mission objectives, and yeah, we've got to get the components from down south, which, honestly, um, we could do as a kind of a bit of a run uh, until you get to the part where you've got to go into the uh, Arctic to get some of them. Yeah, uh, and that was the thing, is I was just kind of, uh, I was going to try and see if I could get... Uh, figured I was just going to gather resources and then I realized I could make armor that I had enough points to be able to do it. Yeah, uh, so fixed, we'll want to get fur armor before we go in there. I'm fixing to break my pickaxe and my axe though. Well, then it's time to introduce you to the nearest cave. Uh, so we can, uh... Ha! <laughs> uh, they make such cute noises when they die. All right, so yeah. Um, snakes. There That's where he is. So yeah, blue marker is a cave, and yeah, what my plan was going to be, I was going to push towards getting a large amount of metal, get a concrete furnace up. It's not strictly required, but yeah, do you want to deal with polar bears without a gun? No, we probably should have guns. Polar bears sound angry. It's, so, it's all cold and makes their dangly bits cold and it makes them hot. So, like, we can do it. It's just, we have to, you know, really nail that whole kiting polar bears thing. And you thought a bear was hard to kill. Polar bears are something else. To, to be fair, the, the bear that I killed by myself, I, I did with the, the starter bow and the stone arrow. Yes. And barely killed but it. If, <laughs> but barely. if a polar bear takes 15 seconds on a good bow and good arrows, a polar bear can take a minute. So yeah, no, we probably should. We should probably get guns. That's so. All right. Breaching cave. Picking up the 
Pronto. Pronto. But yeah, so uh, if you guys don't know what Icarus is, uh, it's a rivalry based building game. It's, you know, except for. Uh, oh, good. Novel. One sec, game, and I disagree on where I am. I bumped into the rock wall in multiplayer, and uh, I think the server thinks I'm slightly differently positioned. Because I can hit it, I just can't hit it squarely where I'm hitting. So, sorry about that. It does not like that. Nah. Rejoining is a... Uh... Is a fun problem. Am I supposed to dig in this hole? Well, I'm trying to open this, uh... Trying to get it all the way through. If you can take out the back of it... I'm afraid of getting smacked with a pickaxe in the back of it. I've stopped, because I can't... Just open up the back of it, because... At some point, a worm will probably start trying to shoot you. Just be oh, aware good. of that. But yeah, for some reason, it won't let me open the back of the cave. Oh. My items work. Let's see if it'll let me... I... Oh! I could open this now. Thank you. So That's our first tree. job will be to get enough together that we can get your pickaxe. open enough now I've just got to go Flip. aim for the heads Yep. So that will uh, hurt a bit. Do we need copper? No. Give me, will, give me copper maybe. crossbow bolts. Yeah, I. Crossbows aren't as good as I'd like to, would like them to be. Oh. That makes me sad. Come on, worm. Born in. Oh yeah, I can do that. There we go, on the left. Ha <laughs> ha, suck a fish. Uh, yeah, this is a left-right split. Right. Fuck, I've got a spouse. Yeah, I didn't manage to nail the shot. Alright, give me just a second. Oh shit, uh... Ow. I'm still using stone arrows, that's what's going on. Oh, I'm using my shit. If you've already got them in your inventory, hold R and switch type. Uh, press 5, play support. Let's start. Oh, look there. I can see the sun from here. Alright. 
kill poison set. Try to push, press G to throw a flare at Pete. Yeah, I've done that once or twice. Alright, that should give us enough lighting in here that the worms won't pop up again too much while we're in here. Yeah. Do you have mining perks for these? Or? Uh, I've also got a better pickaxe, so Don't initially what we'll do... Um, if you can... Uh, have we got a stone furnace back at base? Uh, no, but we have stone. Uh, I have a ton of stone in my inventory. If I give you some of the stone, if you can work on getting a stone furnace together, I'll come back with a crap ton of iron. Yeah, and... Like, oh, if don't carry too much. If you carry, if you fall, then just All right, because you don't have the. Sorry, I forget how many perks I've got, and I've got a lot. He told me it was. It was... Oh, it's windy out. Oh, wind sucks. <laughs> yeah, this cave's actually pretty good fun because, uh... There's a deeper uh, mining ore deposit in here for iron, so... Like a bunch of stuff. If we run out of iron in the cave, we can get more iron in the cave. Iron in the cave. Oh, dude, I messed that wolf up. Where's your buddies at now? I hear him. Eyeball. Granted, it was from like six inches away, but you know, dumb deer didn't know I was there. <laughs> dumb deer. Some more bow arrows, so I forgot what I need to make those. Four I had level up. Nice. I leveled up from level 50 to level 50. Oh, I need it when that happens. Uh, I'm at the level cap, so. <laughs> All made right. level 50 about about 400 times. Something like that. Where else? It's out. Here. Not 
Okay, now I've also got some coal, but that's not for using as fuel. Oh, I made a drying rack too. Awesome. No, I put these in. Way back. Stone furnace. Do I need to make a yeah, fireplace? Let's... Um. Oh. No, through. just the stone ones. The stone furnace. Stone furnace is our entry point into getting smelted materials, which will let us have. <laughs> Only I knew a god had something. Oh, who am I kidding? I know a guy. Thought he knew a yeti. Yeah, that guy too. Do I need to put this thing outside? Uh, nope, just, uh, it'll get damaged by storm, so it's got to be inside. What is this um, thing? That's our, we already had a stone furnace. Oh. Well, I guess then we can dual wield furnaces. Yeah. Oh, well, we can break them down for the, um, concrete later, because we'll also need to make a machining bench and a concrete mixer and a concrete furnace. This is my drop, so, press it. It's in here. You know, that's a smart idea. I didn't think of that last playthrough carrying around with broken tools. Yeah, that'll be I don't forget them. Or throw them on the ground. Which is probably more um, likely. I will probably more likely just throw them on the ground. Say I'm part of your system, man. <sighs> Over encumbered like crazy. Yeah, for some reason it tells me that it's still waiting for the streaming software to send me. I think is what's it? happened is Exploit started a new video instead of that one. This for us, the new one. Do the old one. Activate. Okay. Silica ore, anyway, do we? I don't think I've picked any up. Okay. 
Off I go. I'm currently, uh, cooking the iron. Get rid of it. So once it's done, we'll make an anvil. Make your basic metal pickaxe. And then we can, uh... Feel like rabbit up carcasses. The... Yeah, we can progress up the tech tree of, uh... Getting guns. Oh, uh, charcoal is a useful resource. So, so I... make note of that. I've been stuffing it in a box. Cool. We'll need it to make gunpowder. Yeah, I've been. I put a box next to it because it's one thing I learned in games like this. You don't throw shit away. Oh, another cave right here. No, just a weird hole. Oh, this looks so. I'm so good to get. So the caves in this game, for those who aren't aware, are randomly enabled. So caves have three states when you start a prospect. They're either already open, they have a rock wall in front in front of them or they're completely closed and they just look like a normal part of the walls. So that might very well be a cave that you are near from, but it okay, might so be that this time around it's closed. I found a <laughs> copper node. Well, that's good that they move stuff around, kind of make it a little bit more random. Gives you some precision joint generation with uh... An opportunity to generate a map. Who are you, Buffalo, scaring the piss out of me? Thank you, Buffaloes. I need to unlock some stuff in my tech tree. I have three points. Did Buffalo come around the door? Right around the corner. I couldn't speak because I thought it was a bear. God, okay, crap, I'm well, dead. I now have an animal bed, water trough, and food trough. So if you wanted, since you know, Stuff is going to take time. We could screw around with that mechanic as well. Uh, yeah, I don't know. If you want to do that? Try to do that tonight, or I just thought I'd let you know that you know we could, we could actually tame a buffalo. Just build up some resources and get ready. And, uh, hit it tomorrow, um, and then tomorrow morning. Uh, Right and early, we'll be streaming on Twitch, uh, playing this thing, uh, kind of continuing on. Afternoon, I'm not sure. I'm not sure what we get. Yeah. Furnace ran out of out of the funny wooden stuffs. Funny wooden stuffs. Also known as wood. No. Oh. Like is that is that the funny wood stuff that's only legal in Colorado? What? Oh no. What am I supposed to do with no, the silica ore?
So for now, put it in. So now just toss it in the mortar and pestle temporarily until we've got the concrete furnace together to shift it out into a concrete furnace, concrete mixer. Because I think we need silica for concrete. I don't know, there's, there's a lot of different recipes I end up doing, like I end up, last time I did this I ended up going down the route of getting stone building pieces because I got tired of the, um, the storms taking the building apart on me. That's not optimal, that should work. stack of wood in the anvil, that way we can just use it as a general repair location as well. Alright, that's not what I'm going to do that. Unless it doesn't recognize. I wonder right, if it doesn't... Uh, you say? I wonder if Lumia doesn't recognize commands in uh, YouTube. Because it has set for level permissions for Twitch. Who knows? Alright, uh, do you have the ability to craft your own iron pickaxe, or do I need to do that? I believe so. I can make, a, I can make all kinds of stuff. I can make a shovel. Make it nails. Oh, we Yeah. Yeah. Oh. yeah, but I don't have much iron in there yet. I'm still melting stuff. But yeah, the reason I wanted you to do it, of course, was experience for you. Alright, there's some more iron in there. Alright. Now you've got tools. Oh no, an axe. Yeah, axe. Oh, oh no. Did you just take that? I'll oh, give you that back. Yeah. I just realized what knife that was. Please, please put that somewhere safe. That knife was yeah. expensive. It cost me 25 credits. Yeah, I'll probably put it back in the... Like, right there. I still have the bow uh, on, but the bow's not taking a lot of damage. And actually, the no, knife's not taking... Pretty good. The knife's not taking a lot of damage either. Yeah, that knife will, um, the, the MXC knife will let you harvest, um, second tier animals. Yeah, the steel knife is, the iron knife is better though. It's 200% health and skinny versus 150. You can yeah, throw but it? I believe it's, you can throw it, but you will never find it again. Yeah, I, I didn't think it would be a good plan, but I just, I was, I didn't realize you could throw it. <laughs> Sadly, it's one of those, it's great in theory kind of deals. Alright, so, I now need to get uh, 62 ingots of iron, and 12 of those need to turn into nails. Connect. Yeah, so make the tools you need first. Okay. And then we'll, you know, go from there. You need to ask somebody a question. Ah, uh, I get it. I don't get it. Alright, let me see myself out. 
Uh, so and then the other thing too is that uh the youtube notify for sapphire just says published a new video on you yeah so it doesn't realize it's a live stream all right yeah Oh, you went and collected a lily. Picked up something. If you, would collect, I... if, you, if you collected more of those, I could make you the thing that deals with concussion. When you inevitably have a tree drop in your head. I have five more. At one point, I was running around in the front yard at the dark, just picking up sticks. Wow. Uh, let me let me find more fibre. Gives me sprees for stuff I already found. Points of available for Petri. One point available for that. Unlocks the ability to turn wood into sticks. Yeah, that can help you get out of sticky situations. Yeah, or into them. Okay. Right. Stick me in a position. Okay. Well, we have the herbalism then. not strictly a required bench we need. In the event that you cave your head in with a uh, tree, it will help. Yeah. That that's never happened before. Sure, I'm sure it probably would happen. Take the eight out. Let's make it twelve. Oh, I didn't even see the wall. That works. I'll go. I'm not upset about shooting the head by accident. Actually, I can, uh, I can definitely think of, um, something we'll want to take in with us. We'll go want to have a pot belly stove and some building pieces in our bag when we walk into the, uh, the Arctic for the fun run. Yeah. Because uh, once we get there, we'll want to put something on the uh, on the pot belly stove to to generate heat while we're in a small room waiting for something to uh, to do a thing and destroy the room partly. Well, that didn't work quite how I intended it.
Oh, good. That worked out well. Hey, do you need a baby buffalo for anything? Uh, well, I mean, we're not set up to start the taming process yet, but I mean... Okay. Well, Danny Buffalo, uh, not, not, has not done well. Oh, oh no. How unfortunate. May have may have caught a rogue arrow. That may or may not have been aimed at his head. Mm -hmm. Yes, I, I can see that being quite unfortunate. Well, I, get, I get tired of his bear impersonation. It scared me. What? Like it. short on the um on the bones I needed bone knife are you by taking bone a bone knife, knife I mean, and by bone knife I meant bone sickle oh Now I have 300 fiber. Yeah, fiber. But yeah, so the bone sickle is a really good tool. It lets you um gather a hell of a lot of fiber. And given that I have the recipe that lets me turn fiber into rope, it can be handy. Shit, don't face. Well, I'm glad you already collected a lot of sulfur. Yeah, I found some. There's some more up here. Well, I need to make epoxy, and there's two ways you can do it. You can either grind bones, or you can mix tree sap and sulfur. Okay. You can guess which one of these is less painful. You're saying you don't like grinding bones, though. I'm... I'm partial to not doing it. Do I see if there's some more stuff over here I could have? No, we've got, we've got enough. I think we should have enough. Nope. I'm pretty sure we have enough. Nope. Nope. 
Nope. Nope. Nope. Is that a you need assistance now? Or nope, nope. we don't have enough. Nope, I got another dead one. Ah. He was biting me in my stabbing hand, and I didn't like it. Ah, so that's the poor decisions, nope. Got it. Yeah, the armor does help quite a bit, though. I, I do like the I do like that idea or, that I had of of making armor. <laughs> Greatly slows down the wolves from chewing on my, uh, well, the, the bits of me that I need. I'm wondering which bits those are. It's all of them. I need all of my bits. Uh, <laughs> some days, some days I make myself. That's the important part, Pete. Kind of for the uh, raw meat. Uh, raw meat. Oh. We keep that raw meat. Uh, just eat as much as you can. Do we have anybody we could sell some meat to? No. We are the oh. only ones on the planet. That's going to slow down my uh, plans for world domination. I'm going to have to make the floor bigger. Uh, I'm going to make some sticks. Big, big sticks. I'm going to go collect fiber. Plan for the building to get slightly bigger. It told me I can make sticks out of out of trees. I think it might. I take it you got the talent. I think so. Then you have to unlock the blueprint for it too. What? Yeah. That, that so seems. It double dips. That seems overly. It's on tier one. It's uh, right next yeah. to the coming soon water bomb. One, two, three, four. Times ten. Holy crap! Makes a lot of Make enough arrows, never have to worry about running out. To get a concussion? Uh, sadly, yeah, yeah. It might, it might be concussion time for you. I'm sorry. Yeah, I love concussions. Wait, no, that's that's the concussions talking.
it's the chopping down trees in this thing gives you a good amount of experience. It does, which is nice. I feel like you're just wasting your time by cutting the tree down. I like to get that perk that automatically picks up the logs and chop them down. It has like... a caveat for that one. Uh oh. It's important that you know before you think about it. When it automatically picks up logs, it has a tendency to cause the tree to fall towards you. Oh. So, if you use that, you have to start making sure you're further away from the tree. Otherwise, you will always get concussion. Concussions are the best! Wait. Okay. Because, off? yeah. You can end up having the tree crush you on your first, um... usage of it. Right. So know that, uh, if you get trees are your friends, then the trees like to be your friends. I like I like how they have the one too that uh they actually have one called trees or friends that reduces the damage they cost to you in half. Mm -hmm. is in a few more levels I'll be able to uh, uh, I assume you don't want these I think you have not stacked up with one I probably oh not good what's up oh me and the wolf just had a discussion Did you win the discussion? Yeah. Good. He, uh, I squared off with him and I pulled my, 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 uh, my, uh, shiv out and he starts wagging his tail like, oh, he thought he found a snack. I'm like, oh, do you now? <laughs> he did so well. I don't know if my oh, oh that's why for some reason it's dropping it to 480 it's messing me up For reminding me, actually, I need to make sure mine's not at 480, but mine is at. Oh, hey, you're transcoding. Cool. Well, I think that's just a YouTube thing. I don't think they divide it up for. Uh, I, I think YouTube just transcodes. Consistent transcoding? What is this? Because pretty much no matter who you look at or who you watch, like you always have the option to, of dropping. So I don't think it's a. It's not like Twitch where you have to be a partner or you have to, you know, be like the top one percent of the people streaming a game to be able to transcribe. 
Yeah, I could no. be wrong. I, I don't know. Yeah, we can keep the uh, the soft meat and the stringy meat for the drying. Oh, okay. I didn't know the soft meat went out there too. Yeah. I've made space in the... Um... I may try to move the other stuff off. Yeah, that's all good. It's good stuff you learn over time. I got the stick. So, I'm gonna be slowly moving the crafting tables and stuff into the new section, leaving oh. the old sec the first section for storage and stuff. That way we can keep it a bit neater. But yeah, this this new section is fancy with windows and Oh Fuck track bears. That is probably what will happen. What the new section will be so fancy it tracks bears? Yeah, I think it's up to hell. I think it's full of picnic vessels. Well, sadly, we can't tame this. We can't name one you. I know. I was gonna name him Poo Poo. Poo Poo. Hey, I made a level 19. Yeah. Level okay. Wolfie Boy. Come here. Come on. Uh. 20. Oh, you called your friends in to stop here. Oh my lord, you got all your friends. You good or? Well, I'm better than they are. Because I'm still alive. They're the dead. Oh, that was, that was, uh, that, that was the, well, that's what happened. <laughs> All right, we'll definitely need more iron. But on the bright side, uh, we've got some spare iron. In the, well, we've got some iron in the anvil, but I want to leave it there purely just so that we have plenty of iron in the anvil. Here, so. I have a bit late to repair uh, the disasters. Mm. All right, we now have the ability to make concrete. Stone and solid stuff from around the place. Put it in the cement mixer. Ah! Are you trying to murder me? 
concussion. Yo, it, it needed me into the atmosphere. I thought I was great for a second. Uh, I was more so trying to determine were you, were you having the concussions? No. I went just, I hit it with an axe and it like flipped me up into the air. Because, uh, yeah, at any point, I can make a blood thing hitting on like to, I to gently you're, resolve you're that problem. Hoping, hoping I get a concussion. I feel, no. I'm starting to feel like you, you want me to no. get a concussion. No. I'm just looking out for you. Like, trees, trees love giving you concussion in this game. So, like, you have a misdealing with the tree, and I'm like, do you need medical aid? Your story, tell how you want to. I'm not trying to throw trees at you. I, I didn't say you're throwing trees at me. I just say that you're rooting for the tree to win. back to the cave for a tree sap but at least we now have a way of making concrete and before you ask concrete building pieces are kind of annoying because you need steel screws and steel rebar for them uh, but do they stop the zombies uh, I don't know. Never had to deal with zombies, so I wouldn't really oh. be able to tell you. They do, however, massively slow down the whole, um, you know, wind breaking and thing. stuff. Yeah. So, like, once we've got guns, it might be worth if we can get enough extra steel together, putting a concrete roof on this place. Looks like you'd want some of the walls to be concrete also. Yeah. Well, I mean, even going stone would be cheaper. Right in the yeah. ear hole! Nice. But even going stone, which would be cheaper, we just have to do the initial investment of a shit ton of iron nails, would resolve our wind problems. But like once where well, I suppose a stone building would be better to take with us into the Arctic because so spoilers for anyone who hasn't played this mission but basically after we collect the three pieces we then have to set up a building at a certain location place a thing in it and babysit it during a storm the arctic which is cold yeah. so the building takes damage so wood isn't the greatest thing here thatch does not even survive for a second you can do it with wood buildings but yeah i mean if we wanted to have anything more suitable and resilient we need to take something like stone so but of course, the better the building we go with after wood, the heavier it's going to be. You can get metals. Sorry? Charge me, you stupid deer. I keep getting metals. Okay. Gathering fur. Oh, yeah, those are this game's version of achievements. I think they actually do something. Yeah, they're, they're the accolades. Oh no, they don't actually do something. Freezes. Yeah, you hit escape, not escape. Uh, your inventory button, then go to accolades and enlist them all.
I love that I have professional wood builder. Yes. Which is, uh, construct 1,000 wood building pieces. Only got 100 stone, though. Have not done concrete or aluminum. Yeah, it's just not and fury wood. Yeah. Well, I mean, there's not much reason for me to push into the better. Um, the only reason to do it would be to, uh, once they get the dedicated servers. Yeah. And when they get the dedicated servers, I I plan to disappear into the into a server for a while and just build something massive. Because I want to push, unlock, you know, the tier 4 tech. Get the resources together to play with it. Now that we've got deep mining nodes, getting the iron in that could actually be possible. Yeah. So, I'm looking forward to all that. So here appears someplace, I don't know where it is. I take it it's a dead deer? Yeah. Uh, oh, I think, I think the wolf was trying to eat. Thanks, wolf. Well, now you know where it is. Found it. Roski, how you doing? Yes. Uh, we are... I am diversifying. Uh, so I, uh, with some of the stuff that's going on with Twitch and some of the stuff that is just the, the general, uh, just the general, like, Twitch, Twitch pointing out over and over and over again that they really don't care about, especially small streamers. Uh, it, it doesn't, like, my, me trying to convince Twitch that, you know, I'm, a uh, uh, that, that I'm worthy of, uh, you know, partner or I'm worthy of being boosted. Like, the problem is, is uh, especially with a lot of the games that I play, because I'm not playing Fortnite, I'm not playing uh, Apex Legends. I'm not, I, I'm not doing that stuff, which is really the stuff that that tends to do well over there, especially if you know start getting a following. Uh, it doesn't do well. Uh, moving some of the stuff over to YouTube, uh, just a couple of the videos and stuff like that. Now, now that I'm learning how to talk to the algorithm uh I, i'm getting some progress over here uh i've i've got stuff going on youtube in the last month that make me feel almost as accomplished as streaming for seven years on, on twitch uh, i've said it before i'll say it again uh like I have, there's a, an insect swarm video that we have that uh, has a total of like 630 views in the last like two weeks. And and I, I know, I 630 views on YouTube, not a big deal. Like I, I, I understand that. Um, but to me, 630 views on anything is a big deal. Because I come from a place on Twitch where those views had to happen while I'm live, basically. Uh, for, for me to be able to get anything out of it. So being able to come over here, have a video set up online for two months or for two weeks, and be able to get 630 views on it. Uh, it it's, it's different and it's exciting. Uh, and, and it shows me that, yeah, there is Discover Photo. Uh, yeah, I don't know what that one is. Uh, 
the problem is is any, every time you go to a different a, a new a new thing right there's a chance to get you can get on that forefront uh but the the issue is is you want to be the little fish in the big pond or do you want to be the big fish in the little pond uh right so even even with when mixer was aimed towards artists and, and that's and, and if if you are mostly doing art and stuff like that and that is a better fit for you by all means like do it uh, yeah and the the trick with youtube is is yeah it youtube may not be the best streaming site it may not be the best short site it may not be the it's but it's a jack of all trades site so if you're going to do a little bit of everything youtube for me it's starting to look like a better fit uh i i fought and tried to stay away from youtube for a very long time because oh youtube's a big bad scary boogeyman and you know people on twitch have to hate it because you know twitch is looking out for my best interest which isn't looking out for my best interest. I, I hate I hate to point it out to you. Twitch, YouTube, Picaro, or, or Picardo, uh, not looking out for your best interest. They're looking out for their best interest. They're trying to make money. They're trying to to uh, get food put in their bellies. They're trying to pay their electric bill, and that's not a bad thing. I, that's fine. Like I, I'm not saying that. Uh, a service is is a horrible you know because oh they're they're trying to look out for themselves um uh, it's like if they weren't looking out for themselves i'd i'd be worried about it um but you need to make sure that as you're going into something that you're getting what's best for you right so if the art place is best for you hey go for it you know yeah there, there's problems with each other uh and and that's why i'm still streaming on twitch in the mornings i'll stream here at night uh trying to maybe diversify a little bit so if something happens to one platform or an ad apocalypse happens or uh, uh twitch decides that 50 50 split isn't good enough they're going to go you know 30 70 split uh because they need more money uh which after what they did to the the big streamer taking them from 70 70 30 to 50 50 split to me i just like are that that is and don't get me wrong like i i'm in, i'm 50 50 over there uh i don't think i'll like i i don't see me making partner i i i don't i don't think i can do what it would take for me to be part um and it's just it's that that wall is so steep uh and then even if you do climb that wall to become partner it doesn't really help you any um and then at that point you become exclusive where you can't do anything else like now right now i'm an affiliate so as long as I, when i stream on twitch that that stuff is is has to be isolated on twitch for 24 hours after 24 hours i can bring it over to youtube uh, but I can stream here tonight, which it, and Twitch is, the, you know, it, it's not very good for them because if they were smart, they would allow me to do both, even though I don't know if I would do both because uh, I don't like trying to fight off. Like, I'm having enough trouble just getting YouTube to work so I can, and I'm just, it's, it's working, but I I've broken it somehow. Like, I I'm watching on the web page with everybody else, like like a like a just a regular viewer, uh, to see what's going on. Um, like the studio thing that I'm supposed to be able to see, where my I can look at my my analytics and make sure all the stuff is working. It doesn't work. I've broken it somehow, um, and I'm sure no, it's something. You haven't broken it. So. What it is, is when you set up a stream via um, the site, it's generally expecting OBS. OBS, uh, you give it a stream key and it'll go there. Um, I think XSplit uses your login and creates a temporary key. Yeah, I saw... 
on, when I went over and looked at it again a second ago, now that we have a rain, I'll go look at it again. Uh, but if I go down to the select stream key, uh, there's an XSplit 1080p alphabet suit. And then there's an XSplit caster, broadcaster uh, 1080p different alphabet suit. And I, I tried yeah. both of those and neither one of those like connected. Yeah. So it's it's how XSplit logs into it, like. Yeah. And it's unfortunate because, like, you know, the whole system's set up to. Oh no! I it just it just worked. It said something about oh. duplicate stream key and then like refresh the dashboard or something, and then it popped up, and now I can see everything, and it works. But yeah, so, uh, so it says the stream is healthy. Ah, oh, well, guess stream's eating its vegetables. Oh, uh, that's 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 uh, that's not optimal. What's up? Well, um, are, are you looking at the stream? No. Look at the stream and look at where the watermark is. It's over the number? Well, it shows it directly over my face on my... Oh, yeah. If you have it small enough, it'll be over your face. Oh, is that what's going on? Yeah, so the tiny preview, it's over your face. But if you scale it up <laughs> enough, it'll be out of the way. Oh, okay. It's over the number. Okay. But, I mean... That's, that's not optimal, know. but... <laughs> like, at a small enough preview, it makes the Plum Yeti the Plum Yeti. Yeah. I don't see a problem with this. So we at least, at least a bit of damage, actually. Okay. Oh yeah, we're. I don't have a hammer. Um. Uh. Um. Uh, uh, hammer? Uh, I do, but it's the wrong one. Oh, crafting gear. Uh, hammer. Crafting. Uh. It's I in your right now. pocket. I have wood. I can has hat hammer. I can has hammer. Uh, has hammer. I can understand the tired. Yeah, so, and then, uh... I, every time I say your name, it comes out a different way. But it's it's. Who's key? Who's key? I every time I say it, I, I it comes out different. My brain, my brain just trips over itself. Who's? Who's K? Okay. Anyway, uh, we have lots of lots of ideas. Uh, so anybody that doesn't know, uh, I have uh, I have some ideas. And so we picked up a uh, an editor for our the streams today. Uh, she's working in the background. Why is there? Why is what? Um, yeah, so I have I have a couple. Of... Uh, sorry, just it's funny watching you know the animals pushing a tree around. Oh, good. Uh, but yeah, so uh, I want to probably do some stuff. Uh, so there's gonna be a bunch of different things. Uh, I have. Uh, I have lots of ideas, um, but I know I know you're kind of backed up on, on uh, missions right now too. So,
but yeah, so I want to do that. And then obviously, uh, I, I need a bunch of Yetis for, uh, thumbnails for, for YouTube, uh, just because right now, if you go to the YouTube page, it's the exact same on every single thumbnail. Uh, and I, I would like to mix that up a little bit. Uh, just because I think, I, 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 well, where my thumbnails were a week ago versus where my thumbnails are today, uh, I, they're definitely, definitely a lot better now. Uh, I'm, I'm a lot happier with, with, uh, the current state of my thumbnails, uh, versus, uh, what, what my thumbnails were because a week ago, I was literally just taken and just going into YouTube to the three little things in the bottom going, uh, that one looks good. And just rolling with whatever, you know, YouTube suggested. Uh, and then, uh, so yeah, there, there's, there's lots of stuff, right? Um. Uh, but that also being done, uh, there's been uh, a request uh, for uh, the thumbnails, especially the thumbnails where where it's me and Pete that have uh, Pete have a character also. Which uh, has never so, been a thing anyone's asked before now, but. Well, and, and it makes sense, though, because that way, if people see that both pictures are on the thumbnail, then they're like, oh, okay, there's, there's two people here, and it makes more sense. It seems more planned than just some random voice in the background. Uh, but I like being some random voice in the background. Yeah. And then, uh, as as Deb is uh, editing the, the first couple of videos... Uh, and it, it may be some time before the edited videos come out. Uh, she's learning the software. Uh, she's trying to figure out how to, to edit and, and make something good and, and trying to just basically play with the software to figure out how she, how, she, how it works. Uh, she, uh, there was a couple of things. She sent me a thing today. She's like, Hey, is this okay? And she's, she like, uh, like I ran up and like the fire was off or something. I turned, I lit the fire and uh, she's like, Ooh, fire. And had like a little bubble pop up. Uh, but I was like, well, I go, and she's like, is this okay? You know, kind of, I, I basically told her you can do whatever you want to, as long as it's funny and it makes sense. Like we're not a serious channel. And I go, but if you can make it look like, like it's an editor note, like she put it in there trying to be funny or something or trying to make a joke. So at that point, we need a little character for her. So that way she can have the little bubble pop in and it basically, you know, it's like that way it's, it's her thinking or her talking or something. Um, I, I think that would that would be great. And, and Deb's, he's, he's, he's good people. Yeah, sorry. Plum's going down a rabbit hole. Yeah, it, it's the whole the whole YouTube thing. It is so. I, to be perfectly honest, uh, and and I do nothing less than that. Not usually on the channel. Uh, I I've been disheartened over the past two years on Twitch. Um, part of that is my fault. Uh, I lost. Uh, between November and like March of this year, uh, I didn't stream at all. Uh, I had some massive problems. Uh, my, my dad wasn't doing well. Ended up putting him in the nursing home. I lost him in January. Uh, it, it, it was it was a tough time. Uh, so I five five and a half months or so I didn't stream at all. So that's my fault. I can't like. I can't grow on Twitch if if I'm not streaming. That's just that's how it works. I understand that. It's my my problem. Uh, but in that two years, 
uh, if it hadn't have been for uh, Dual Universe streaming that, I would have had no movement in followers for two to three years on Twitch. Absolutely zero. Uh, I went back, looked at a highlight from like the first like like 18 months in when I was looking at hit 500 followers on Twitch. We're now sitting at 800, and we just can't break it. We just we're you know we've gotten up to like 8:30, and we're just just this horrible two-step that's just back and forth, and it's very disheartening. Like I try not to look at the numbers. I know the numbers will go go make it go crazy, and I don't look at the numbers for the stream and that stuff. I don't look at them, at them because they will drive me insane. But when you are not making progress at all, something has to change. Uh, and that's why with the numbers that I'm looking at on, on YouTube and the analytics that it gives you and the stuff that it gives you to say, hey, this is this is what's going on. This is how many times you put your, your video in front of somebody. This is how many times they clicked on it. This is how long they've watched it. This is where they leave your video when, when they're watching it. Um, yeah, 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 but it, it shows me the things that I'm, that, that I can, the small things that I can change that make it better. Right. Um, so I'm seeing, I'm seeing movement on YouTube and, and it's reinvigorated me and it's, it's made me want to stream again. It's made me want to come home from work and jump on the, on the computer and make a 15 or 30 minute video. It's made me want to start doing things again. Whereas with YouTube, there's been mornings that I've gotten up and I just not wanted to do it because. You mean Twitch? I mean Twitch, yeah. Uh, I, there's been days I've just gotten up and just not want to stream, or you know, find an excuse to not stream or whatever uh, because I just wasn't feeling it or or whatnot, and. It just, it's, yeah. And, and, but, and that's the thing is you want to have fun. For me, I want to grow the channel. I want to grow the community. I want to meet more awesome people. I've met some amazing people. Amazing people that I've met. He and Evie and, and Toast K and, you know, Silent and, you know, just amazing, amazing people that I would have never met if I, ha I wasn't streaming. And we've raised a good amount of money for the hospital, but I want to raise more. I want to do more. I pray that I don't light it burns. Uh, but, you know, so if I can do those little things and we can make some changes and we can have fun, we can we can bring that 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 happiness and that that sense of accomplishment that that we're moving forward back then I, I'm, I'm fine with that. And don't get me wrong, like I'm not sitting there, like it, like I do look at some of the stuff and kind of go, okay, what, what did I do? What did I change here? Why, do, why isn't this working? Why is this, why is this? Work? And there is some trying to figure that stuff out. And there's some of it that's just like, uh, it was the wrong day for that video. Like there, there's some stuff you just got to throw your hands up and just move forward because it, it'll drive you insane. Um, you know, like, you know, the whole freaking, uh, like, <laughs> I have 630 people that freaking watched one of my videos. None of them subscribed to the channel. <laughs> but I, like, I tell people, there's buttons on the bottom. If you want to push one, push one. If you don't, don't. I, you're, you're a human. You have free will. Do what you want to do. <laughs> Like, if you don't want to subscribe to the channel, don't. It's your free time. It's your life. If you don't want to like the video, don't like the video. If you want to dislike the video, do that too. Like, do what you got to do. If you want to leave a comment, I appreciate it. I truly appreciate it if you leave comments, you know, and ask questions. And I try to answer them. Uh, but you're, you're a human. You have free will. You be you. Uh, and, I, and I truly believe that. And... Like the whole, uh, 
Uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say one of the things that I, that I hate it when, when people on YouTube say it. Well, 95% of the people that watch my video aren't subscribed. Okay, well then, you need to do something different then. <laughs> if people are watching my videos and they don't want to subscribe to my channel, I need to, to do something to, to entice them so they want to come back. It's not their fault. It's mine. Oh, God, Pete, we have so much meat. <laughs> Uh, I get on my soapbox sometimes. But it, it is what it is. And it's easy for me to go, oh, you know, and it and it is it's weird and frustrating to see those those numbers where people uh you know aren't doing that stuff because for me right now, like I'm just like, oh I just need a hundred people. I need a hundred people so I can change this stupid thing from alphabet soup to to you know yeti, from yeti, you know. I just need a hundred people. You know, but as soon as I do that, then I'm gonna need 500 people so I can I can make posts and and you know talk to the community. And then as soon as I do that, I'm gonna need a thousand people so that I can try to get partner. Like it never ends. Uh, need more meat. Like it, it, it it's never gonna end. Uh, I I'm always gonna need. I, I I always need more people. I always need more subscribers. I always need more. More followers on Twitch. I always the, you know, it, it never stops. But then on the other side too is on YouTube. It's it's more about trying to get people to push a free button as opposed to Twitch, where I'm trying to get them to push a pink button. So and and I'm actually happier. I'm happier with people just coming in, chilling, hanging out talking in chat I, I'm perfectly happy that people don't have to subscribe uh, I, I much I'm just as happy with the money going to charity um, I actually probably happier with money going to charity uh, because then you know yeah it's yeah, if you need to sleep, get rest. Like, don't don't injure yourself. Like, I have lots of ideas, but like, we'll wait. Uh, and you know, I have lots of requests and ideas and, and crazy stuff that I that I want. Uh, the real trick is going to be trying to get a banner that will work for everything, because the banners for YouTube are. uh because uh yeah ice train sucks uh that, that's why I, my glasses have well i'm supposed to wear glasses because i'm old and i suck uh but i also have uh the blue uh light tint on them so that uh it helps it helps reduce ice strain it's it's helpful Oh, never. You're, you're fine. Like, you're good. Fading, I'm going to bounce. Talk about banners after I've got this, right? Yeah, yeah, no worries. Like I said, I, I'm getting ahead of myself. Uh, and I don't... The last thing I want to do is... Rush you. Uh, because they, I, I truly believe the worst thing you can do to an artist is rush them. Uh, because if I start giving you deadlines and I start, well, I need this next Tuesday, uh, I, I, it's it's not going to be as good. Like, it would be better if I gave you the time that you Does that make sense? Yeah. Right, right in the nose. Yeah, wolves. Both. Okay, what are you? I'm just creating a small pile of death. <laughs> Ow. Another wolf. That makes sense. Um. 
would you, would you like to um I'm over encumbered and I'm surrounded by wolf bodies. I can do it that way. Um but yeah, so and then the other good thing about streaming on, on here too, like I, I'm still I try to keep my, my screen pretty minimalistic uh and not have like just random stuff everywhere. Uh but I don't I don't know if I should start. The cleaner you keep your screen, the easier it's gonna be for someone editing to make changes, do effects. Especially if they need to zoom in on something. Yeah. So yeah, once they start getting really crazy and stuff like that, it, it's it's just it's a lot. Um, and the the problem is if I start putting all the text down one side, and it's just it's just gonna be a mess. Uh, but so it's just, it's all trying to figure stuff out, trying to figure out what's going on, trying to make life as easy as I can on the artist. Uh, That's six friends so far. I don't think they're friendly. I know that. They, they, seem, they seem a little hostile. And I got the deal. So when you're done, we, you can collect the deal. Yeah, no worries. Safe. It's a rest. Dude, I, uh, I just, I have, uh, we'll probably stream early in the morning on Twitch. Uh, and then, uh, depending on how that goes, uh, I'm going to try to, I, I really, I meant to stream last night over on here on YouTube. Uh, but I didn't. Because uh, I went down a rabbit hole. Uh, but... Uh, that rabbit hole basically had me go through all of my uh, all of my videos I, I put on YouTube uh, so far and go through them and update their titles, their their tags, uh, most of the tags. I didn't update all the tags. Um, and uh, the descriptions, all that stuff. So that stuff worked a little bit better. Uh, and the, the data was there that's it, more presentable. Obviously, hopefully a, easier to digest. Uh, that's the, the biggest trick is trying to go from from Twitch to YouTube is the formatting of how things are displayed, especially like right now, because if you're on the video and you scroll down, like I have to, you know, be able to get all that stuff where it's digestible. Um, Increasing I'm gonna need another fire just to put uh Well, you notice how I left a good amount of space and how I'm reorganizing stuff to give you more space. You'll have plenty of space. Did I mention you have space? Whoa! whoa! Okay. No frames. I hate when that happens. Um, but yeah, so it's just, it's it's trying to figure that stuff out and trying to figure out how to optimize stuff for the different format. Uh, uh, probably not going to be doing short form content anytime soon. Uh, like I have some short videos that I made uh, kind of when I was testing the waters for YouTube. Uh, they, they don't have any audio on them. Uh, it's, it, they're just kind of there just to kind of be there. Uh, 
it was just kind of testing the, to see uh, if you he was worthy of my time. Uh, and obviously it is, right? Like for me to think that, you know, yeah, the Picard thing, you know, sheer effing hubris. Uh, is it, it really is, right? It's me, it's me thinking that well, that's not awesome. You managed to elevate it off the ground. Yeah, I may have dropped a box down, and then when I picked the box up, it it, it popped it up. Nice. I don't know if I should stick the fire at the doorway. Can we set ourselves on fire by standing on these? Yes, yes, you can. Okay, uh, so don't put that in the doorway. The only reason there's a hole there is so that light and oh god, um, oh that's god, not good. Uh, the fire whacker, fire whacker, fire whacker. Uh, sticks, shit. Uh, uh, I need, I need wood. Oh, good. My fire resistance and my building pieces kicked in. I'm uh, building out. Okay. So, my building pieces, due to perks, have fire resistance. Oh, that's good. So they can take a bit of burn. Not the front door. One, one moment, please. Yeah, so the, the timing uh, obviously is a little bit weird for us. Uh, Pete's uh, obviously in Australia is the middle of the day for him. Uh, which is not a time that uh, his uh, family and friends and everybody expect us to be streaming. So there may be some interruptions. For me, it's uh, it's midnight. If somebody knocks on my door, uh, it's going to be a weird conversation. <laughs> they better have a good reason. That's all I'm saying it's midnight, you're knocking on my door. Uh, but yeah, so uh, the trick is, is us to, I'm trying to make it look more professional over here. Uh, like, I have seven years of experience uh, streaming over on, on Twitch. Uh, I shouldn't come over to YouTube and look like I just started today. Uh, it should be a, a more professional stream, and I'm trying to make it or a, a more professional channel and I'm trying to have it reflect that uh, so leveraging some of my the, the art artistry stuff like that uh, Toast K is uh, looking at uh, drawing some stuff for us to try to get the artwork up uh, try to get it a little bit more uh, get it refreshed uh, the the drawing and stuff that I have, even though I love my Yeti head, I it's it, it always gonna have a special place in my in my heart. Uh, it's the artist that drew it for me. Uh, I haven't talked to him in a while. In the last few times I tried to contact him, it's uh, not a not worked, and it makes it incredibly difficult to uh, do that. So, uh, and instead of trying to to get a new artist be like hey this is the artwork i already have so uh please fit this box or uh, don't bother uh isn't a very good way to uh to get a new artist uh 
So we're looking at getting the dead to be drawn uh, and basically starting over. Uh, it is what it is. Not the, the most optimal, but man, it was something even better. Uh, so at least that way I'll have the the stuff that I need because uh, I need I need a lot of artwork. Uh, I I can make everything look. Like it's meant to go together. Uh, I need I need a lot of artwork. Uh, trying to carry a, a single theme between YouTube, Discord, Twitch, Twitter, uh, everywhere. It, it it takes it takes a lot. Uh, so that's that's really what my my goal is next, and especially with the thumbnails for uh, for different. Uh, videos and stuff like that I would like to have a handful you know a, a, a few things uh, and most likely what will end up happening uh, is uh, once the artwork we kind of get it put together uh, we're, we're gonna I'm gonna look to expand expanding it to shirts uh, so we'll see if we can get because there's all kinds of people that they'll print anything on a t-shirt uh, so we'll see if we can get some stuff uh, printed on T-shirts. Uh, so if somebody does want one of them on their on their on their shirt, who am I to say no? Uh, it's kind of silly for me to say no. Uh, so we'll we'll look at trying to get that stuff set up. So if if people do want uh, a uh, a yeti head on a shirt. Uh, be able to give them, give them the ability. So we'll, uh, we'll try to cross that bridge when we get there. Uh, trying to uh, get stuff set up and make it available for people uh one of the the things i'm trying to do now and probably i should have been doing a long time ago is instead of me deciding um, deciding how people wanted to be bothered i should have put this stuff out and let people decide how they want to be bothered and when I say bothered, I mean, like, you know, they, some people don't see a notification on the Discord as a bother. They like to have a notification on, on the port. They like to be notified that we've gone live. They like to be notified that that stuff is being put out and that, you know, they like knowing that. Some people don't want to. So instead of me, me deciding as a as a whole, I don't like it when that happens to me. I'm going to make it where it doesn't happen to anybody. Uh, I going to change it so that these are the options. If you want to be bothered, click a button. You can be notified. If you don't want to be notified, don't click the button. If you click the button and then you decide you don't want to be notified, you will unclick the button. Uh, so. I'm trying to take a different approach to it. Uh, kind of uh, trying to uh, have fun. All right. What's up? Uh oh, oh is everything all right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, That's... I was. I was surprised somebody was home, and then uh -huh. I realized it was not a day that they worked, and that I was the fool. Uh, I'm going I to now be. upgrade my pickaxe to something. Uh, it's not about to die. Are you going to steal? I made... Uh, no. The steel is currently still saved for, um... Oh. Working on... The railroad? Gun. The gun. Oh. Did you say Robo? 
I said railroad. Uh, I've been working on the oh. railroad all the ding dong day. Sorry, it's kind of hard to hear you over. Yeah, it's like a Texas thunderstorm. But yeah, so uh, the, the ultimate goal here is to be able to stream on, on YouTube, be able to uh, stream on Twitch, uh, build a community, and and not be like I, I just I want to give people the option of consuming how they how they want. Uh, so if you want to watch on Twitch, you have the time. If you want to watch the VOD afterwards. I'm leaving the VODs up on Twitch. Uh, if you want to watch the VODs on YouTube at a different time, I, we're moving the VODs over to YouTube. You know, once once the 24 hours has expired and stuff like that, we're, we're moving the stuff. Uh, we're streaming on YouTube now. The stuff that's going on YouTube stays on YouTube. I'm not I'm not copying it over to Twitch uh, because it doesn't make sense to me to go through all the work and effort and everything to pick all the videos from YouTube copy them over to Twitch and then have Twitch delete them in 60 days. Uh, the whole part of the reason and most of the reason that I'm moving stuff to YouTube is because after the 60 days, it doesn't delete the bots. They're, they're here. Uh, so whether, whether I'm happy about uh, Dual Universe and what they've done to us or not, those bots still exist on YouTube. Uh, the VODs do no longer exist on Twitch because the 60 days has expired and they've deleted them. So if I hadn't started moving stuff over to YouTube when I when I started streaming this last time, I would have been losing that stuff. So, and you know, as I grow and, and things get better, the stream gets better, stuff like that, it is what it is. But that's still, that's still... The past, that's still, you know, the stuff that we've done. That's still games that, like, I'm, I'm happy to have played the universe. I'm, I'm overall happy with the idea of the game. I'm not happy what they did with the industry. I'm not happy with what they've done to, to, to suck my fun out of it. But I'm happy for the time that we had played. And I'm happy for those videos. And I hope the game does well. I hope it does so well that the devs realize that they can actually make better servers and then they can give us our industry back and then maybe I can go and play it. But at least I'm not. <laughs> yeah, so nobody approached me on the topic of Dual Universe because I do not feel the same way. Yeah. Well, the problem is, is it, 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 all right, I like us. Anyway. Enough, enough beat on that game. You know, uh, the same thing with uh, uh, Saints Row. I'm, I'm very unhappy uh, that I spent money on that game, and I'm glad that that video or that that uh, that VOD of release day of Saints Row has been captured and been preserved because that game needs Jesus. And, and, and I've said it before, I'll say it again. I am not upset with Saints Row because it was, it was woke. I don't care. I don't care. The main protagonist was female. Don't care. I care that the characters themselves were freaking useless two dimensional cardboard cutouts of the saints they had no depth to them the, the story was garbage the, the entire writing for that game is, is just a mess and, and it was so full of bugs and that it was unplayable that's my problem i would have been perfectly fine if they would have just went all in and just like made the my, they went and got Mike the situation from Jersey Shore and put him in the game. Then they went and found a Karen. And just, and just turned it up to, to 11 and just went for it. It would have been great. You know? And then just make them all, you know, psychopaths and 
just let them go just destroy stuff but you know i might get all all excited but so the 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 grand scheme of things is that's what youtube allows me to do is it allows me to preserve that those watches it allows me to preserve those videos and more importantly it allows me to to keep the videos up and, and people being able to see them even when i'm not able to stream so if something happens i catch covid again um because i've already had the crap twice uh i work in an airport for those that don't know uh so I, i'm exposed to it continuously people wonder why i wear my mask at work still today uh so if i catch covid again and i'm and i'm taken out for a week, youtube is still growing people are still coming to visit people can still find my videos people can still watch stuff yeah i may take a hit uh but i won't take as big of a hit as i do on twitch if i don't stream for a week on twitch I, that's done i can't i can't nobody's gonna find the channel nobody's watching vods nobody's subscribing subscribers like it's and that's not why we're here to try to, to claim money but it's definitely to grow the grow the channel grow the brand and try to raise money for the charity uh, and the charity being x life and uh I don't really know what time it is. Top right corner. Seven. Um. So the uh, but the the ultimate goal is to raise awareness and to raise money for extra life. Um, and we don't do that a lot on here, uh, because we we don't have a lot of people and just just hammering and hammering and hammering. Without any people, it's difficult. But I have to change my mindset because people can find this video afterwards. So, uh, for those who don't know, Extra Life, amazing charity. Uh, we're playing for Texas Children's Hospital this year. Uh, Extra Life's game day will be November 5th and 6th this year for us. Uh, the actual game day is November 5th. Uh, we do 12 hours on November 5th. We do another 12 hours on November 6th. That time will start at 8 a.m. Uh, Central Standard Time on November 5th for us over on Twitch, uh, twitch.tv slash Plum Yeti. Come and hang out, please. I'll be giving games away. It's it's a lot of fun. Uh, we'll be there all day. Uh, afterwards, we'll get the VOD to go here to, to That one should be fun, uploading a 12-hour VOD to I'm sure that's going to go well. <laughs> yeah, that'll stuff. break it. I can't download it. Like, holy crap, that that would be probably 30 gig. Anyway, so, uh, but we're going to go do that. So what uh, Extra Life is, if you don't know, uh, Extra Life is the gaming branch of the Children's Miracle Network. Uh, Children's Miracle Network was started in the 70s by Donnie Marie Osmond. Uh, it specifically raises money for, for primary children's hospitals around the United States and Canada. So... If you live in the United States or Canada and you or one of your siblings has not benefited from, from a children's hospital or you think you have it or you don't think that you know somebody that has, go talk to your mama. Go talk to your mama and talk to your aunts. I, I promise you, a children's hospital has been closer to your family than, than you may know. Personally, if it wasn't for Texas Children's Hospital, I wouldn't be able to walk. The lady I met at the at the convenience store today when I when I went and got my soda, uh, she said she had meningitis when she was in first grade. Uh, it was so bad that it ended up putting her in a coma. If it hadn't been for Texas Children's Hospital, she would have been dead. If it hadn't been for Texas Children's Hospital, I wouldn't be able to walk. Like, and there's story after story after story. And the reason we do this, the reason we raise money, the reason that I'm streaming at all, the reason I do all this crazy stuff is specifically to try somehow to repay some of that money, some of that kindness that that hospital and that, that surgical staff provided. 
to maybe so that they can help another child. Uh, so uh, what happened was uh, when I was about nine, nine, ten years old, it was a long time ago, I don't remember, uh, I stepped on something called a hurricane glass. Uh, it's a uh, weight glass, I'll call it jinx coming up. Uh, why it was at my house, how it got there, who knows. I It, it was there. Um, it, it, whatever, right? Uh, so uh, it was it was rainy and stormy like this outside because I live in Texas. Uh, so we weren't allowed to go outside, so we were running around inside. My mom told us not to run in the house, so we kept running in the house. Uh, at some point, uh, between me, my brother, and my sister, as we're running around inside the house, somebody tapped the cabinet that this glass was setting on, glass fell on the floor. I stepped on it, put my foot in the Honestly, it's, it was a miracle I, I, I survived. Uh, every time I talk about it, my foot hurts. <laughs> it's like it knows. Uh, but so I ended up cutting my foot from the bottom to the top all the way to the bone. I spent 12 hours in the operating uh, The surgery staff stopped counting 200 stitches on the inside of my foot, uh, 14 stitches on the outside of my foot. Uh, and you got to remember, I'm nine years old. My foot's like this big at that point. All right, a little bit of time for it. Uh, the doctor's flat told my mom that they were afraid I would never walk again. The doctor straight looked me in my eye and told me that I would never run again. To which I responded, screw you. You're not the boss. And, uh, because that's who I am. Uh, so, uh, obviously, I, I've lived a, a long life. I spent 15 years in the Navy. When I got out of the Navy, I was running 10 miles a day. Uh, it never slowed me down. My foot, I have some pains in it every once in a while. Nothing too major. Uh, but my foot works. I can run. I can walk. Uh, it, they did an amazing job. So if we can raise a little bit of money and possibly, just possibly, allow that hospital to help another child to have a normal, normal life, I'm all for it, man. I honestly, like my, my, my goal is to help that hospital continue to do what they're doing to help other children to have hopefully a normal life. Uh, and that's, uh, that's where we are. That's what we do, what we do. And that's what we do. Uh, so if you guys are around November 5th and 6th, we'll be over on uh, Twitch. Uh, we're playing a game called Fortress Craft Evolved. Uh, if you're not sure what that game is, there's a couple of playlists on the, the uh, YouTube channel here. Um, you can go check those out. Uh, please go watch them. You can kind of see what it is. You'll go see us just building this massive factory and weapons and, and bullets. Uh, we're taking a break from that right now just because we're trying not to burn ourselves out. Uh, we'll probably, probably get back into it here soon. Uh, just because uh, we do have some stuff we need to clear out before we get uh, too far away from it. Uh, and then when November 5th rolls around, we have to be able to, to be ready uh, because I've got to blow up, oh, well, I say I, but people he, he, be helping me. Uh, we got to blow up four spawners on the surface uh, and try to do that while people are feeding bunnies to the donation machines and pissing off the bugs. Uh, so the way it works in the game is uh, there's a small item Every time I put one of those items in the game, it makes the bugs 5% stronger and 5% more angry and 5% more buggy and just generally not not a good day. Uh, it would be like a, just every time somebody donated $5, just throwing another honey badger. In. It's, it's just, it's that much fun. Um, so... The idea here is, is for me to try to survive and keep the base alive as people are donating money to try to murder me and see at the end of the day who wins. So the way that we're going to do that is I have six hours that I can't, I have to be able to turn on the, the, uh, the, basically the threat agitators. Uh, I have to let them run for about give or take six hours uh so about noon between noon and two o'clock in the afternoon we'll start charging the, the oet the first time uh we'll we'll plan of charging the oet the second time uh towards the end of the stream 
Uh, so between like six and eight o'clock at night, we'll, we'll do that. Uh, and then, uh, so we'll, we're only allowed to have two of the charged and uh, fired first day. Uh, and then we'll fire the uh, second two on November 6th. Why can't I hit this stupid wolf? Really? Not now you did it. Um, but yeah, so that's the, the plan. So if you guys are around, uh, like I said, I don't know what's going to happen when I try to upload those to YouTube. But I'm going to try. So, so. Oh, because I, I may have to, uh, I may have to just straight download those and, uh, have them divided up into, like, one hour, like, things or something, and then, then upload them that way. Is the, uh, ha having a 12 hour stream, there, there's no way it's gonna, it's gonna do well. Yeah, YouTube doesn't do uh, do <laughs> long form content. When I say long form content, I mean you know three hour streams. Like t this one will probably be okay because it's a stream, and YouTube knows it's a stream. Uh, when I bring something over from Twitch, it thinks that it's a, it thinks that I just uploaded a video, and it's just like yeah, I don't know what to do with this. It's all about learning how YouTube works. And uh, like I said, well, uh, I'll probably, I may just do that. I may just try to download it. Uh, it'll probably take me two hours to download it. Uh, but I should be able to download it. Uh, have it divided up into hour long segments and got back. Maybe the better way to do it. It is twelve thirty Pete. Is it? It is for me anyway. Oh. So I'm gonna probably look at shut down and, and call it a night uh, because uh, oh wait I will be up streaming on Twitch in five and a half hours. Oh, no. Oh, six and a half hours. So, uh, we'll go ahead and sit down here. Uh, and then we'll let you guys have a good night. Uh, if y'all are around, uh, I, like I said, I stream on Twitch, 7 a.m. to 10 a.m. Central Standard Time, Tuesday through Saturday. Uh, and then we'll be trying to stream on YouTube in the afternoon, evening times, on the days that I don't work which are Sunday, Monday, uh, and normally on Tuesday, and, and sometimes on Wednesdays. Uh, it's just it's just a very so my schedule. My schedule kind of gets iffy uh, towards the end of the year here. Uh, we'll do what we can, uh, and then kind of go from there. And then, honestly, uh, may, may come over and stream on, on YouTube for for, uh, for New Year's. We'll, we'll see how it works out. All right, you guys be safe. And then I make sure I can, uh, I think I can just end the stream over here. You guys be safe. Oh, I, I'm supposed to tell people to like, you know, there's buttons down. If you push the, the, the follows and the likes and the subs or whatever the hell they're called, please do that. It seriously does help the channel. So, all right. Thanks guys. We'll talk to y'all later.